okay uh, let me figure out the problem first okay this let me draw the mold let's take this as proof this is the main runner the cylindrical riser have to be designed this is the cylindrical riser then the plate so the casting itself is a rectangular shape it's kind of plate okay so then this is the when uh, motor metal goes to this uh, screw due to the gravity it flows to the runner system then it enters to the riser and the casting cavity of the casting this is how the motor metal flow inside the mold okay then this uh, casting the dimensions are given the rectangular shape rectangular shape plate let me draw the casting a 2 cm thickness uh, its length is equal to 2 12.5 cm its a depth that mean the width is equal 7.5 cm and also the uh, solidification time for this casting is given the 1.6 minute uh, total solidification time for this casting so 1.6 uh, minute okay so why this uh, data is given to find the uh, mole constant to find the mole constant wait let me first of all uh, i'm going to apply the torino rule for this one so first of all before going to apply the torino rule we need to find the volume and the area okay casting volume casting volume is equal casting volume that is equal to uh, 12.5 into 7.5 into 2 that is equal to 187.5 cubic centimeter okay then the casting uh, surface area casting uh, surface area here we can calculate that is equal to uh, 12.5 into 7.5 into 2 plus uh, because there are two surfaces 12.5 into 2 into 2 so again the two surfaces plus 7.5 into 2 into 2 Okay. Then this uh, casting surface area uh, is equal to 267.5 square centimeter. Okay, square centimeter. Then uh, we can apply Chorion's uh, rule to find the uh, mole constant. Okay, Chorion's rule to find the mole constant. Okay. Total solidification time of the casting. total solidification time of the casting is equal to cm this is the chorion's rule the v divided by a into the exponent 2 then the problem is given 1.6 minute the cm the volume we already calculated that value 187.5 uh, cubic centimeter here is uh, minute divided by the total surface area 267.5 square centimeter into square okay so then uh, we can uh, calculate the cm so what is the unit here uh, let me simplify this one c cm into 0.49 here cm square so that the unit is equal yeah, cm is equal at 3.2566 minute per cm square cm square this is the uh, mole constant okay see the mole constant that is also valid for the uh, riser design okay so then we are taken this uh, cm to calculate the riser uh, dimensions okay 
then uh, the cylindrical rice i have to resign cylindrical rice okay let me take the uh, rice this kind of a cylindrical rice sorry so having let's take its uh, height as h the problem also says the cylindrical rice will be have to resign the height to uh, diameter ratio is 1 so that its uh, diameter also equal to h so that what is the volume of the cast uh, rice the volume of the rice volume of the riser we can calculate what is the volume of the riser the v is equal 5 cross sectional area h divided by 2 into square into h that volume v is equal 5 h cube divided by 4 okay so then the area also we can calculate area also we can calculate the two uh, circular area so that uh, 2 5 r square so that means h divided by 2 into square plus this uh, curved surface area 5 into h that is the perimeter of the circle rho into h so then uh, we can further simplify this one further we can simplify this one area is equal yeah, 3 5 h square divided by 2 okay. so then we are going to apply this uh, two values into the chorinus rule okay okay then uh, i'm going to apply this uh, chorinus rule for this calculation a total solid solidification time is equal the mole constant into the volume divided by area into square this is the chorinus rule then uh, total solidification time required is equal to 2 minute 2 minute then uh, cm we have already calculated that cm value this is the cm value we calculated so then we are going to use that value for this calculation uh, 3.2566 uh, minute per square centimeter then uh, volume of the casting volume of the casting is equal 5 h cube divided by 4 divided by area 3 5 h square divided by 2 into square okay then uh, then we can simplify this one 2 divided by 3.2566 is equal you can cut yeah the 5 h cube divided by 4 into 2 3 5 h square into square then uh, Then uh, yeah. we can cut these two, and uh, here this uh, h we can cut, and uh, one here is two, the two into three six six into six square, h square uh, thirty six two three point two five six six. So then we can calculate the h value. Uh, h value is equal uh, uh, 2 into 36 divided by 3.26566 uh, into square that h value is equal h value is equal 4.7 centimeter okay so that mean uh, riser 
if you take the cylindrical riser its height should be a 4.7 cm and also its diameter also should be a 4.7 cm in order to give a 2 minute solidification time for this mold okay thank you for watching